Hi and welcome to this edition of Mobile Tech Videos. I'm Josh, also known as Connection2005 on the forums. Uh, feel free to check out our brand new website, mobiletechvideos.com. Uh, just got it up and functional. It's a great resource to uh, to browse around, and see all the videos we have. We'll be working on getting more content on there every single day, so check that out if you have a chance. Uh, today's video is going to be about SMS backup. A lot of times when you're going to ROM or do something that's experimental and you may risk crashing the phone, it's always good to make uh, backups such as titanium backup for application use, but uh, there's also more specific applications uh, to backup things like SMS. So as we can see here, we've got a thread, a single thread here, so we uh, know we want to back that up. And we've got two messages, uh, it would be great if we could back these up. Well, you can check out the latest video at our website. And uh, we want to back that up. So what we need to do is go out to the market and get this free app. It's called SMS Backup and Restore by Ratish Sahu. It's a great application. I've been using it for a long time. It's got a ton of features, ton of functionality. There's a free and a pay for, which is kind of like a donate version. Uh, it's, it's a fantastic app. Give them five stars there and uh, go ahead and install that once you've installed it open it up and you'll get a lot of options we've got backup restore view delete backups delete messages uh, and the donate button and you know we're ad supported so we're free right now um, yeah if, if you really do enjoy this app please donate I mean it's a heck of an app for free so um, also if we click our bottom left button and go to preferences we get a ton more features We've got schedule settings. We can actually set schedules to run the backup as, as often as you like. We can use archive mode to just simply add to existing archives. Uh, we can change the location of the backups. We've got all types of options for changing the date formats, uh, whether or not to use contact names, uh, whether to disable vibration at the end of operation. I mean, he, he pretty much put an option for everything uh, in, in, the, in the preferences, which is great. So check that out, and what we want to do is click Backup. It's the top button. You'll get a, a name of the XML file. We want to say OK. And bam, successful two backed up, uh, total of two. Nothing failed. I uh, just want to point out, this is called SMS Backup and Restore. It doesn't support MMS. Uh, you know, my recommendation is if you're a big MMS guy, then you really should just go ahead and save those pictures to the SD card, so that way you don't have them in SMS threads anyway. You actually get better functionality by viewing them through a gallery. You can zoom in on that. You can't do that in SMS anyhow. So anyways, once you've backed up, go ahead and do what you were going to do and we'll meet you on the restore side. Okay, as you can see, we flashed from the stock 2.1 over to a cognition based ROM. We've gone into our market on this ROM and we've downloaded and installed SMS backup and restore for the new device. Uh, we've kept the files on the internal SD card during flashing so they weren't overwritten. If you're really worried about it, you could also back those up at that time. Uh, go ahead and press open. Say OK for the free version stuff. And we want to choose restore this time. Now it will pull up any XML documents that have backups in them. We see the one that we had originally. We'll choose it and we'll say OK. And we'll say yes when it prompts us. And we've restored successfully two out of two. So we'll go back and go into messaging and bam there is everything that we backed up we've got the one thread with the two messages all in perfect unison and uh... well i've noticed that for larger uh... threads you will see a little bit of uh... out of organized uh... situation don't worry about it i mean after a day all your top uh... threads will come back to the top as you begin to text people so that is how to back up and restore SMS applications uh, for SMS messages on the Samsung Captivate and other Android devices. Feel free to check out other videos that we may have. Check out mobiletechvideos.com, any of the forums that I'm on. And as always, good luck.